everyone. <coughs> I know. Surpri oh, shit. Dragon. Uh, most likely surprised to hear me. I am alive. Still got my hard drive issues, so I'm being really cautious with it. And I've been wanting to play some Skyrim. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm alive, like I said. <coughs> well, as alive as I could be. Yeah. <coughs> Still got a little bit of a cough. Still vampiring it up. Excuse me. Lydia, stop coming to my room, everyone. I know, Lydia. I know. I do feel kind of bad if my kid lives under the stairs. Well, not really. I have bedroom under the stairs. All right. Hmm. This actually looks pretty cool. I, I want to change up the hat, though. I need something better than Cicero's hat. Hmm. What do I have that's better than Cicero's hat? Cicero's hat gives me 35% better sneaky, which is really freaking good. But it's a Jester's hat, so I don't really want that. You've got to change it up. Uh, see, I got that for sneaking, sneaking, sneaking. That alone is 78% chance more sneaking. How much more sneaking do I need? <coughs> well, let's see what we got for hats. Uh, clothing should be over here. Yeah, clothing's right here. All right. Sort by body type head. What we got here? Angel Trout Call. Cool. Hold on, what was that? That's not bad. Let's take a look at that. Let's take a look at that. I'm going to lose a little bit of sneaking just because how much we actually have right now. Oh. That's it right there. That looks good. I mean, it looks goofy as hell. But I think it looks a little bit better than Cicero's hat. Alright, Cicero's hat, you're going away for now. I mean, seems outrageous to do. I need, I want better but cape too. What do I have here? Uh... Head, I don't want head, hands. Do I even have any cape? Body. Hmm. Yeah. That just looks cool. Tribunal on armor. It's unarmored. That's still a downsize. It's unarmored. Do I really need both of these? No. How am I doing on money? Now we're okay on money. Whoa, whoa! Oh yeah, I forgot how cool that looked. Man, it feels good to be playing Skyrim again, even though I'm just... <coughs> I think most of the game for me is idle management. <laughs> <coughs> Dying freaking chest is still killing me a bit. But nobody knows bad as it's been the past couple days, or the weekend, or Thursday and Friday. I can actually talk. That's a lot. All right, I was getting really worried. It wasn't loading, but I wasn't going to say nothing. Oh yeah. Oh, I forgot. I'm not a fan of the daylights. Skin's as pale as the snow. You scared of sunlight or something? Don't worry about my sunlights. <laughs> How can you see my skin? From dragon or giant, we'll be ready. Will we now? Okay. Let's see what there is to do. What are we doing? <laughs> Too boring to do that. You know what? We could do that. Now well, listen, I'm leader of Dark Brothers. This is my duty here. Words of unholy matron. Which commands you out. Let's see if I can help him with it. Uh, yeah. Uh. Uh. Yeah. It's my call about. I've already adopted someone. So we do that. I don't really care about the Ninru. Find cash in the Pies Pirate Shrine. That could be something. Source of power and SharePoint. 
Ooh. Hmm. We need to talk to the Bard's College, too. That could be fun. What do you need? There's bound to be some fun in the Bard's College. The Bard's College. It's probably it's practically the party town of Skyrim, probably. They're probably full of fun times. A vampire like me will fit in perfectly. Even more so if they let me live in the dorms. <coughs> it is rather bright out. <coughs> hmm. I am desperately holding on to the warmth of my last victim. <laughs> you think so? We'll take a look. What do you got? Oh! That was level 20. That's not bad. Not bad. I mean, I have better. I think. You have a wooden sword. That one seems worth getting just for fun. Ooh. Ooh. No, I think my current boots muffle sounds. That's very good, too. What's that? Oh, we've had that before. Oh, crap. You got lots of poison, so. Uh, let's see if we got to get healing potions. Yeah, I'll pick that up. So you have skooma? Oh, skooma some tempting. Moon sugar, we'll pick up some moon sugar. Some salt. Always require we'll some salt. Soul gems, yes. Alright, we're gonna buy some soul gems. We're gonna do this. Alright. Soul gems time. <laughs> Hello, I heard you had soul gems yourself. <laughs> My buying outfits are ridiculous, but the prices. There we go. We can, you know what? We can buy that. I think we give that to a gift as our to our daughter. We'll find out. I mean, ten for a soul gem. Yeah, we'll buy them all. Uh. Real expensive, but tempting. We'll pick them up. We'll pick them up. Do I have anything worthwhile to sell? Probably not. What do we, yeah, we'll have we hold on to that. What's the vampire dust? Hmm. That chill rand. I need to recharge chill rand. And I have to recharge my Justicar knife. All my charges are gone. Holy cow. Alright. I hope that you will touch. I hope you have a good day too, if that's what you're trying to tell me. Alright, sneaking. Night Eagle Superior. Sea Dog Cape. Sneaking. I'll think about it. There we go. That is my outfit. And what we'll go ahead and do. Man, there's so much work to do. Just get ready to go venture. Pardon me? We should we'll put Petty in this one. Spelled out right. Yeah. There we go. Hey, Shadowmere. So where was I going again? Uh. This is Bard's College, right? No, I remember I had to tell someone that someone else was dead. I want. I like to visit them first. Tell Anarchy the Bandit is dead. We can do tell Anarchy the Bandit's dead. That's not too bad. <coughs> Mara is the goddess of love and compassion. No, they managed to be asleep when I come visit. You mean to crave and taste of blood again? Okay. We can handle that. Hey. There's a I used to be an advent. You remind me of myself I do? years ago. Let me show you a little bit about wearing light armor. Okay. Oh, I've got the itch to travel again. Thank you. Leaving town, I wouldn't mind coming with for a while. Huh. Okay. Shimmer, we're gonna wait here for a little bit. 
I'm thirsty, Shadowmere. Well, oh, this is gonna be a challenge. I like it. <laughs> Look at all these guards. Oh. Hidden. Hidden right in front of Who's sleeping here? Huh? Tell me, you sleeping? Oh, <laughs> well, that dragon in the distance. No, I don't want to do either. I don't want to do either. Try to think of it as coaxing the old. Hey, how you doing? Rock. Can I push me out? Safe push track. me out! Push me out! Come on! Push me out! <laughs> Dragon, come help me! All right. Excuse me. All right. We need solutions. I'm gonna go to shouts. Where's my shouts? Uh. I'm not gonna like this. Shadowmere, do you see how cool that was? Alright, Shadowmere, we got some work to do. You saw. Oh! What did I unlock? Oh, Dream Mentality? You know. You saw the Dragon 2, didn't you? Could just be like a dragon hang out here. Well, then again, we can. Do I really come kill it? How many dragon souls am I? I got three souls. I mean, honestly, no. You know what? Don't even care about dragon. It can't hang out. It's not bothering one. The Blue Palace. Investigate the Bard's College. Let's go investigate the Bard's College. I want to put that speechcraft necklace on. <coughs> But even if the yield is accepted, the guard will still rest. The taste of your is almost gone already. I'm a hungry vampire. Holy cow. Let's see how we look. Very presentable. Wait, is it night, night time again? Oh, hello there. Seville Stentor has a grasp of magical theory I yeah? would never have expected from a human, even a Breton. Yeah, tell me about it. No doubt most folk in Skyrim... Are you court wizard? No. That honor is Sabeel's step and keeps himself out of the dungeon when she's having a bad day. Oh. You are free to leave. Okay. Well, I meant that's what we're sleeping anyways, but... It's locked. Excuse me? Hmm. Times around. Oh, it's only okay. It's not that late. All right, here's what we'll do. We're gonna put our stinking necklace back on. We're gonna sulk in the sally for a couple hours. We're gonna feed real quick. Have it. That sounds. Where are you at? Pardon me? <laughs> She's just sitting there. Alright. She's still awake. She just sitting there. Okay, I thought that was a dragon. Well, look at that red moon. Easy. Going in. Now she should be asleep. Just 
sleep of it? No. That's just more than one bed. Yep, more than one bed. Feed. Delicious. Can I feed again? Can I go double or triple feed? Well, let's do it. I, I imagine if I feed more, it'll last me longer. Excuse me? Why are you, why are you still asleep? I'm mean, awake. It's like <coughs> one o'clock in the morning. We'll wait, we'll give her an hour. She was looking tired. Oh. Where are you going? You on the bed? Maybe she's got someone sleeping upstairs. Let's make some simpler. Come on. Delicious. Well, we might as well get the 10 feedings. I mean, we're right there. We'll get the 10, because I imagine that might unlock it and make it stronger. And maybe it might make us so we don't have to feed so often. Proud Spire Manor, huh? Oh, that requires a key. I was going to crack it open. Crack it open. What I need to do is find a couple. Hall of the Dead, no thank you. Run. That's where all the sound is. Keep hearing the sounds. Let's go to ourselves. So we're gonna quick save. We've done a lot actually. Easy. We're practically we're practically a master thief. This is a shitty house. Oh, we're in the basement. No wonder it looks shitty. Excuse me? Huh. Probably shouldn't be feeding off people rich and powerful. <laughs> oh, we meet again, Bellarad! Fancy meeting you here. <coughs> I definitely think I'm somewhere important right now. I think I'm probably going to end up regretting if I get caught. Hmm. Stairs are probably the big danger zone because... Excuse me? Alright, we're gonna quick save. Quick save isn't working. Someone's out here. Hmm? We're gonna go out the way we came. Not worth the risk, and why isn't quick save working? Set before. Okay, we'll do that. 
Right, yeah, I was having alt tab issues. Okay. Knockbook save should be working. Yep. All right. We'll get rid of the mouse. Put it up there where it belongs, out of my sight. All right, we need to go find one more sap sleeping. Where is this an idiot? This looks like a big house. Yeah, let's go to the palace. We're gonna vampire our way right in. All right. Huh. Spirits of the unnatural magics are coming from that cave. Who? There are strange noises and lights. We need someone to investigate. Then we will immediately send out a legion to scour the cave and secure the town. Tavengar's people will always be safe from your enemies. My plan is to just stop them here. Dragon Gate is under attack. Okay. I don't want to sleep in that bed. We might go see if we don't want the jar roll over there. We good. Hmm. Could be interesting. Man, is no one sleeping in the Blue Palace? Holy cow! I thought he won't be sleeping in the kitchen. That's outrageous. We didn't have to bed over here. Definitely went this way. We're never quick saving if we're about to go feed on someone important. Me from the Yarl. <laughs> to Binnings, my bloodlust is now satisfied. Hop. Hello, everyone. Hello. Oh, look at you. If I needed something from you, you would know it. Oh. Um. Yeah. Not really. Varnius Junius is a fool. I'm sure nothing will come of it. Okay. I suppose if you're truly interested, you could talk to Falk. He's the better <coughs> safe than sorry type. Fair enough. Were you there when Hiking Torg died? I was, to my shame. The whole court was in attendance. I've seen much in my time, but that was a gruesome day. Was it? Talk about it. How did it happen? Ulfric showed up at the Gates of Solitude, requesting an audience. We thought he was here to ask Torrig to declare independence. By the time we realized Ulfric was here to challenge Torrig, it was already too late. Hmm. Well, was it too late? By Nord custom, once the challenge was issued in court, Torrig had no choice but to accept. Fair enough. Had he not, Ulfric would have had cause to call a new moot and a new vote for High King. Torrig had some martial training, of course, but it mattered little that day. When Ulfric's lips parted, yep. when he unleashed the power of the Thum, that shout, that ancient and terrible tongue, ripped Torg asunder. Holy crap! Okay. What's your problem? Nothing. I'm busy, and I don't like being bothered unless I'm expecting something from you. 
Oh, don't give me that look. Fine. I suppose I can find some menial tasks to set your mind on. <laughs> I don't know if I like her or don't like her. We have something of a vampire problem. Really? Bodies have been found with blood drained. I know of a den nearby you can wipe out as a precaution. Huh. I'll see what I can do. I don't expect you to be capable of even that. <laughs> okay. All right, Sibyl. I had you figured for a minute. <laughs> I think you'll appreciate this. Let's stop for a moment. I'm looking at your eyes, Sibyl. Oh, that could be useful. And I won't lie, I'm sort of suspecting you're a vampire as well. If I had to be honest. Uh. <coughs> Ooh. Uh. Vampires are clever hunters. More clever than you, definitely. Do you have business with the court? I'm talking to Cyborg. Holy crap. Be quick. I have little patience for mundane concerns. Well, first I gotta talk to the Bard's College. Then I'll talk to <coughs> the Vampire Leader. And when I say talk to, I probably mean slaughter them all. I wonder if I can eat vampires. Well, not eat vampires, but um, feed on other vampires. Man, this cloak looks dumb. See, that looks so much better. That cloak only gave me light armor anyway, so who needs it? Light armor's overrated. Armor itself is overrated, to be honest. Alright. We're well fed. The jarl had a little taste of the jarl. So let's see what's going on now. Hello. Welcome to the Bard's College. I'm the headmaster here. And welcome to a fly. Always a pleasure to meet a prospective bard. You should be aware that many apply, but we accept very few people. Okay. When possible, we ask applicants to perform tasks the college needs completed. In this case, I do have a task befitting an aspiring What did we do? Elisif has forbidden the burning of King Olaf, a festival put on by the Bard's College. We need to change her mind. To convince her, I want to read King Olaf's verse. Part of the poetic Edda, okay. the living history of Skyrim. Unfortunately, the verse was lost long ago. Okay, and that's where. Yes, according to Giraud, our history's keeper, the portion of the Edda dealing with King Olaf might still exist in Dead Man's Respite. Okay. I need you to retrieve the poem. Oh. I wish you luck in finding the verse. That's actually not too bad. I think I've been to Dead Dead Man's Respite. So this is going to be amazingly easy, I think. <laughs> Alright, we got a couple of things to do. To the Fames and... Kill the leader. Okay. Oh, we got to do this first. My bad. Yeah, we got to kill the leader. Now it should definitely appear on the map. There's one up here. I've not been there yet, but I've been to Hag's End. So we'll travel to Hag's End and then we'll go help the cave. Your base is remember if out feeding increases your power, so that reduces for anyone that makes your ability to regenerate health. Ugh. Man, so Shadowmere, are you nearby? Wait, what? Why am I? It's not where I want to be. Damn it. Is that your merit? Is on the closer then? Hmm. There you are. Hey, Shimmer. I think we do have to go west. Actually, I don't know where we gotta go. Uh, yeah, west. So, both markers. One south. Yeah, Dead Man's Respite. We have not been Dead Man's Respite yet. Okay. We got some stuff to do then. Alright. Huh. 
Hmm. Try to think of the best way to get this cave where the vampires are. We're going west would be an optional one. Well, it'd be optimal. Crossing the mountains possible too, but it could end in failure. Hmm. Sorry about that, guys. I thought I muted my mic. Well, hello there. The Legion's always looking for strong, capable warriors. But you are. You've got what it takes. My headquarters is inside. Well, I no, I easily do. But I'll never serve Caesar's Legion. Oh, Shadow Man, we gotta take care of this. <laughs> Freeze bear, freeze. This bear does not want to die. Man, those bears, snow bears, they don't mess around. They have a ton of health. <coughs> I mean, I, if I was sneaking, I could one shot it. Part of me. Nice. Good kill, Shadowmere. That was worth it. <laughs> Alright, the cave should be over this way. Nice, Shadowmere. You really have trivialized traveling. Probably my favorite horsey. High Moon Cave, huh? Alright, Shadowmere. This is where I take over. So let me go to this. Sneaking. Sneaking. Mm-hmm. Sneaking. Alright, quick saving. But this may be a trap. It would be sort of neat if it is. Like, oh. Pardon me? Wolf just chilling, huh? Something's up with that. Huh. Random wolves, huh? Hmm. What were they looking at, though? Something's going on here. This is not like the other vampire cave we found. And our health regain as a vampire is nuts. Some of that just going on up there. Very worth it. Looks pretty cool. I'll think about it. All right, that's a stronger vampire red red card, huh? Yeah, I mean, well, I'm here to take a little bite, you know. All right, this is interesting. You're named. No, you're not. If he was named, I'd try to see talking about him, talking to him, but just been named Master Vampire. Nope, not good enough for me to spare you. Yeah, what just 
All right, that was easy enough. Eh, too heavy. That's our file. That's really our file. Huh. Hmm. Interesting though. Man, God, I love these books. Yeah, let's just got a knife. I don't really care about the and arrows, to be honest. Why is your bed covered in blood? That's just unsanitary, to be honest. I mean, I understand the whole vampire blood thing. I sympathize, I really do. But you don't need to cover your bed covered in blood, too. Can I sit here and just feed? No, it's a one time feed it, huh? That's cool. See, y'all doing the vampire thing wrong. I think I'm doing it right. The whole sneaky and mask thing? So cool. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me? Really don't know why you all have skeleton things going on. That's such a creepy. Hmm. Kind of wish I could just feed on people outright in the middle of the day. If they're standing up, if I could sneak on them. Definitely, I should be able to feed on people like that, too. I mean, that would honestly help me out a lot. But, all right, Griff's right here. Probably be Marthrall. But that'd be a city. I don't want to go through multiple load screens. So we'll go to the Dragon Bridge and hit the road. Now I'm all unleashing Razor Snow. Dragons from blue brought down. Oh, God. Well, it's nighttime. I mean, while I'm here, what time is it? Oh, it's only 8 p.m. That's fine. I'm not going to feed on someone then. I mean, I recently just fed, too. So, I'm fine. But I'm pretty sure that person who's in charge is pretty sure she's a vampire, too. Which direction is it? It's going to be southeast. All right. This way. These fish, you just see the fish jumping in the pond. I thought that was neat. Mm -hmm. That wolf? No, that's a goat. No, that's a deer. I was way off each guess. Oh, it's going over here. Yeah, excuse me. But what's really sad is you really think one guard's enough to protect you. I, honestly, well, maybe against normal people it is, actually, now that I think about it. I've got some really pristine weapons of armor, so one guard's really not anything big deal to me. Hey, dog. It's kind of creepy, random doge, just chilling on the sidewalk. Or street, whichever we want to call it. Ooh, what we got here, Shadowmere? Excessive skeletons? Shadowmere, you know I you know how I love my skeletons. I just can't help myself. <coughs> Ugh, sorry about that. Hello, skeleton. Don't give up, skeleton. So what's this place? Are we going the right way? Yeah, we're somewhat going the right way. Interesting. And there's a stone right here. Let's go see Shadow and we'll red that stone. Let's take care of the skeleton on the road. I mean, it's dangerous to leave a skeleton on the road. You never know who will find it. 
some kid could have found that skeleton. He could have tried to put it in his mouth or something, or her mouth. It would have been, great. It would have been unsanitary, to say the least. What's going on over here? This appears to be a stone. But there's sign of some magic of. Uh, so. Cancel, that's boring. Boring! Magica. Psh! Worries about Magicka. I want to start reading about magic. We're going to start doing some magic, guys. Just a heads up, by the way. Because I think I'm lethally strong enough because I can almost one shot dragon. Oh, look at that skeleton. Just a little bit more upgrades. I can one shot dragon. That'll be fun. Well, if I'm sneaking. If I'm not sneaking, I can't one-shot a dragon. It's a little bit of work to kill a dragon then. <laughs> Alright. This has got to be the area. I think I'm in the right way, right? Yeah. Let's keep going. We're going to get the Spards verse. Man, honestly, I swear I've been to somewhere called Respite. Oh, look at you. What are you doing all over there? Good? Oh. oh, the troll fall down? Easy enough, right, Shadowmere? No, I want to imagine this place is guarded. So, Shimmer, I want to take you to the road real quick. Maybe not. Alright, this is interesting. Let me go take a peek. Elemental just chilling above someone. Okay. Feet. Oh, I'm on fire. Interesting. So I can feed off dead bodies? I can feed off freshly dead bodies! Okay, this makes this vampire thing really not easy then. I just gotta go kill people. Easy. I'm good at that. That means I can literally take Brotherhood of the Dark Jobs. Just go kill people for feeding. That actually makes sense. That does explain how she said he's alive. Well, it's funny, man. I warned you. I did warn you. I said, don't even. Okay. That was a change in sound. You gonna be good out here, Shadow Mirror? I imagine you will be. Lovely. Always good to find embalming tools outside. Well. Wish me fuck. Let wish me. Okay, words are hard. Wish me luck, Shadow Mirror. Hopefully, there's some people in here. I'll be upset if there's just dead things in here. <coughs> I think it, it's called Dead Man's Respite. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Drew me a little beverage. Alright. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Now let's come say hello. Like I was playing an instrument. Hello. Ha 
I don't know what happened there. <coughs> but something happened. I think they just gave up. Well. Excuse me. Always are food in their bodies. Wow. So this is I'm imagining the exit to get out quickly. Alright. That's easy enough. That's one of our shortcut later on later on. Alright, back to sneaking. I got a bunch of soul gems I need filling. There. The whole not activating pressure plate things is really useful too. Ooh. I'm A-OK -okay with the soul chips. I need it for my weapons. My weapons are constantly just not having charge. Hmm. <laughs> what a vicious door. Are you serious? I really do hate these spiders, they're so gross. Hmm. Interesting. Scourge. This guy just standing in the middle. You're not that tough. Don't look at me like that. Ooh, my game. Nice. And we leveled. This has been worth it so far. Oh. Don't get up. No need for you to get out. Ever. Okay. I don't know where I'm going now, but I think I'm going the right way. Well. Oh, come on. I really do hate these spiders. Ugh. So fucking gross. All for these soul gems, so probably quite useful. Excuse me. Huh. <coughs> I imagine that might be immediate death. But we'll investigate that shortly. Let's find out. It's not immediate death. Oh, get out of my way. Filthy rats. You awake? Oh, yeah. It was alive. What are you doing up? Go back to sleep. <laughs> this game is boiled down to just consisting of me walking up and meleeing people. Don't even need the full 30 damage, just 12% extra damage does it. Wow. Huh. Yeah, oh, shit. <laughs> Get wrecked. Oh, I actually made the jump.
please stop. <laughs> so far, so good. This has been incredibly easy. Sooner we'll run to enemies where I can't just jump on them and kill them quickly. Or I'm waiting for an enemy that survives. Once the enemy, a enemy survives, that's when I'm in trouble. That's when the fun begins. Pardon me. Okay. This is new. Huh. No effect, huh? Interesting. What are you? Oh, Death Lord! <coughs> he survived! He took a hit and was like, that's cool. I don't know. Alright. I mean, I killed him. Sure. Oh, hello. Yeah, it's dead, so I resist soul trap. That guy was just chilling. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, never mind, this might take a moment. There we go. Okay, master? Yep. Uh, do I think help with lockpicking? I can't remember if it or not. Mm. I think I, I forsake all my lockpicking gear. Yeah, I did. Oh, we found it right away. How convenient. Gotta be a little bit to the right. I'm slightly concerned both my weapons are up while I'm doing this. Oh, nope. More to the right, huh? Oh, that was almost it. Damn it. This is gonna take that perfect movement. Told ya, perfect. All right, Ebony Bow, Amnes. That's not bad, okay. Don't care about the bright armor, but that bow could be worthwhile. We gotta remember, bows are the first thing I put a lot of points into. I was gonna be a sniper, archer person. So I'm not, I'm okay with doing the bow. We'll take some of them wraps. Excuse me. Um, okay. You wanna challenge me? Huh. So I'm guessing there was some Extreme danger happening when that thing was open. Okay. Easy enough. Oh. Appreciate you going away. And you. No soldier large enough. Okay. I'm actually A-OK -okay with that response. Alright. What am I missing? Looks like we're going deeper down, huh? How about that? Oh yeah, it's down here. Cool. Oh, come on, more spiders? Oh, man. Oh, hello. Oh, 
going by. So he just died and was showing up down here. Cool. Well, that was simple enough. Hmm. So where do we go now? Well, there'll be a shortcut somewhere. Would be convenient. Would be very convenient to have a shortcut. Oh, hey! Oh, you're going out to steal the door for me! Thank you. Oh. There's more to this than I thought. Okay, I did grab that thing at the beginning, so let's take a look at it. Uh You have a son, you have so many soul gems. Well, our soldiers we have is ridiculous. There we go. Let's take a look at this. Uh, uh, we want to be like this. Here's to be bird, wolf, bird. Wolf, bird, wolf, bird. I'll level up whenever I feel like it. Alright. I don't feel like leveling up right now. That's right, the keyhole. Oh, I'm assuming that means we did it right. Cover how many dragon claw. What am I even doing? Is there like a dragon heart here? That'd be neat. <laughs> he drew his weapons and ran over here, so that ghost has gotta know something's up. Hey, ghost. Excuse me? Hola. It is time. You hold them off. I got a plan. Don't get ghosts. There we go. That's how I killed you. Off all these scourge, and there's a dragon word up here. Come to me, word. Teach me thou what thing. Uh, Fury of Roman. Okay. That sounds fun. <coughs> uh. Okay. Uh, unlock. Yeah. Oh, we have the key. Huh. It'll take that. It's worth a lot. We'll take it. 
Uh, not worth that much for it to wait, but that's okay. I feel dumb. I feel bad not taking it. And this will be shortcut to the beginning. Where I meant to go sleep hard in the first place. I imagine. Yep. You here to meet me? Nope. Well, I did my part. I feel okay about that. That was a pretty eventful little dungeon. I'm happy. That was fun. There were some ups and downs. And by ups and downs, I may mainly be fell down pit holes. Um, found some enemies that took more than one hit to die. That's the most impressive part of this whole <laughs> adventure. Okay, that's what we got level. You know, let's do Magicka. Yeah. We're gonna learn some Magicka. No, let's see here. Sneak is good. I want to do some enchanting. We gotta learn on enchanting. I want the extra effect, so we gotta start putting points in here. Let's go ahead and get our sight full up. Does that mean all my current chants are better? That's the question. No. So I'm probably gonna remake all those chants. 